Welcome to our presentation on our accepted paper uh, entitled as Applied Engineering Mathematics to Explain the Physics Behind the Hydrodynamic uh, Shear Layer. This paper had been accepted in the Second International Conference on Engineering and Advanced Technology. Uh, the authors of this article is uh, Ammar Abdelkadim, which is the I am the presenter of this uh, presentation. In addition to Professor Dr. Ala Abbas Mahdi and Professor Dr. Ahmed Kadam Hussain from University of Babylon, uh, as well as Professor uh, Assistant Professor Dr. Sachendra uh, Roth from India. This paper actually is a mathematical uh, expression for the three region on the boundary layer, which they are all of us know these uh, layers: laminar boundary layer, transition boundary layer, as well as turbulent boundary layer. So we actually take a flat blade and uh, for uh, we analyze the most uh, governing equation regarding the fluid flow and uh, shear layer in order to make uh, a derivation for the rate of growth uh, uh, as well as the skin friction factor, uh, drug coefficient, drug force, which are the uh, which they are really important in solving uh, and simulation the subject related to the fluid flow over not only the flat plate but also missiles and uh, rocket uh, road vehicles so we uh, we firstly start by uh, by writing the governing equation which uh, they are the momentum equation for hydrodynamic boundary layer over a flat plate and make uh, many assumption okay after uh, the assumption is listed here as you know the flow is steady and the uh, actually the fluid is continuous uh, uh, both in time and space uh, and actually the viscous shear force in the y direction has been negligible so we firstly derive the von Kármán momentum integral equation this equation actually is valid for laminar and turbulent so we derive this formula for uh, uh, fluid flow over flat plate by taking a control volume so we first start by the laminar boundary layer uh, there are four four uh, major uh, profile of velocity profile for fluid flow over a flat plate. Uh, thus, uh, we present uh, a relation of skin friction coefficient. Uh, as you know, we started by this formula, and after that, we uh, find out an expression for rate of growth of laminar boundary layer over a flat plate, which is as indicated here. Now, uh, the drug coefficient is. Uh, really important in the aerodynamics uh, problem so we drive its relation uh, and uh, in, full, in full details after that uh, um, there is uh, another solution which is the Blissus exact solution because uh, uh, the fluid flow in the in the laminar uh, region can be solved using analytical uh, so, analytical Blissus exact solution and also we can utilize the different velocity profile in order to find out the major characteristic of boundary layer. So you can see uh, for this uh, linear velocity profile, the rate for growth relation is uh, in terms of uh, local Nusselt number as indicated uh, here. Okay. The drug coefficient also is this value, but when the velocity profile had been changed to this profile, this relation will be like this. After that, we change, we transfer to the turbulent boundary layer. The turbulent boundary layer, unlike the laminar boundary layer, have only one velocity profile, uh, which is known as the parental uh, uh, seventh root uh, law profile. So we um, make the derivation in order to find out the relation of uh, friction factor with respect to Reynolds number in the turbulent region. Also, we find out the rate of growth relation as indicated here. Uh, also, the characteristic of turbulent boundary layer had been derived in, in full details, and also the skin friction factor in the turbulent region had been uh, derived as indicated here. Uh, finally, we transfer to the mixed region. Uh, there are an important points here that we show that we obtain it when we read the previous previous work. The analytical solution for the mixed region is limited. If we compare if we compare the variable solution in the laminar and turbulent 
region. There are a lot of investigation had been done on this uh, on these two layer, laminar and turbulent boundary layer. But the mixed region there are uh, uh, there are limitation on find out any expression for the rate of growth in terms of Reynolds number. So uh, this article have uh, this uh, have this uh, good step in in uh, in filling this gap by present. Uh, and full details expression for rate of growth on drug coefficient in the mixed transition region. So we take this is a schematic diagram, illustrate the, each layer, as well as, as you see here, this is the beginning of the transition region, this point where the turbulent boundary layer start from this region, this boundary layer thickness in the laminar region, this is boundary layer thickness in the turbulent region, However, in the transition region, um, both of uh, turbulent boundary layer thic uh, thickness and laminar boundary layer thickness can be related by this formula that uh, presented here. I wish this relation, okay, uh, boundary layer thickness in the turbulent region is nothing but 1.4 of its value, but in the laminar region. So we find we select as a special case study the sinusoidal velocity profile in the laminar region. Also, we take um, um, the necessary mathematical manipulation in order to find out this relation of boundary layer thickness, okay, in the laminar uh, of the laminar boundary layer in the transition region, okay, in terms of Reynolds number. Similarly, we take uh, the similar procedure for the turbulent boundary layer that had been uh, illustrated before. After that, we sub of this value here in order to find out uh, the thickness, okay, the length of the turbine transition region in terms of Reynolds number. And also, you find out um, a friction, a skin friction coefficient in the transition region. Also, the drop coefficient had been um, presented and uh, discussed and uh, derived in terms of Reynolds numbers. So we think that uh, this solution actually uh, fill the gap regarding the, the variable correlation in the transition region. This, uh, this is the step number one because we shall develop this work by using this equation, this formula that had been uh, derived in full, in full details uh, to use them in a CFD uh, codes, uh, maybe fluent or even console because uh, we would like to make a comparison study for fluid flow and had been calculated or predicted from this correlation and uh, how the value will be will be predicted if we use uh, another CFD software like ANSYS COMSOL or Fluent uh, in order to make a comparison and uh, to see the accuracy of this uh, relation. This is our work. Thank you so very much.